never crossed my mind that I had to start to be friends and make my peace with the disease that became the second biggest killer in the world, cancer. This uncontrolled growth of abnormal cells ferociously attacks the body tissues. Not contagious, but is painful and exhausting. According to the World Health Organization Globacan 2020 data, 19 million people worldwide have to fight for their lives against cancer. While in Indonesia, more than 3,000 new cases appear every year, with breast cancer occupying the highest charts in women and blood cancer in children. Undeniably, this cancer problem can have an impact not only on patients, but also socially, economically, community, and even the country. For men, especially for women, who are the pillars of the state, as well as children as the next generation of the nation. Walaupun aku sering masa sedih dan takut, tapi bu dokter selalu bilang kalau aku anak yang kuat dan hebat. Alat dan obat-obatan juga makin canggih dan bisa bantu aku untuk sembuh kalau aku tetap semangat. Saya cukup beruntung karena mengetahui lebih awal bahwa saya mengidap kanker dari hasil pemeriksaan dini. Semoga fasilitas penanganan kesehatan di Rumah Sakit Kanker Darmais dapat terus berkembang dan tetap memberikan pelayanan yang terbaik. Cancer can cripple love, nor can it destroy hope. There are only two options left. Give up or fight with all our might. Because God didn't promise days without pain, but a strain to keep fighting. <laughs>